Okay. Tanika. I'm live. Hey, hey, hey. My name is Forrest Gump. But y'all can hear me right now. How about now? Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? I bet you can. Okay. Cousin Kuda wanted to come out and play today. But, you know, I have to, I have to restrict Cousin Kuda. Cousin Kuda. Cousin Kuda be saying some crazy stuff. Hold on one second. Somebody trying to call me and stuff. In the middle of my streaming. And I really can't talk. Somebody calling me. In the middle of my streaming. When I really can't talk. Go ahead. What's up? I'm screaming. Oh, I won't. <laughs> Take him back and tell him I don't miss no class. All right. Bye. All right. All right. All right. Here I'm back, y'all. What am I talking about today? What y'all want to know about today? You know, as your special herbalist, because I know I'm y'all special herbalist. You know what I'm saying? I have to be honest with people and stuff. Because everybody ain't going to be honest. You know, most people are afraid to tell the truth. I'm not. So with that being said, since I'm not afraid to tell the truth, boom, boom. Y'all know. The truth is supposed to set people free. It ain't supposed to enslave people. So, what am I talking about? Oh, I know what I'm talking about today. Now, we all got problems. Okay, everybody got problems. But I thought I'd keep it simple. It's going to be a short one because I got class today, so I can't talk too long. So, I did want to bring Cousin Cooter in, but, you know, he kind of crazy. Let me see if I can add Cousin Cooter to the scene today because he's kind of stupid. If I go over here, no, nope, don't want no other group. Get rid of that group. I want to add Cousin Cooter because he always got something to say. Always got something to say. But I got to figure out how to add him. I think I click on this. Oh, I know how to add him. Boom. Okay, so go here. There we go. Let me, let me bring Cousin Cooter in because I know y'all want to talk to Cousin Cooter and shit. You know, it's stupid. Ain't it? Cousin Cooter be saying some dumb stuff. I mean, he be on point and stuff, but, you know, you know, everybody's special. Cousin Cooter's special too. Shit. <laughs> shit. He more special than me. You know what I'm saying? He is more special than me. Tell me I did not tell you. Like he grown and stuff. Okay, so, okay, so actually, what I was talking. Y'all done listen to white people for too damn long. See, he started that shit already. Just way too long. <laughs> you know better. <laughs> you know, you know better. Because it could stop. Why you going to listen to somebody else? <laughs> now, if you go to one of their houses, they got to be there. A bow day, a beer day, that's something spraying some water to rinse that shit off of their ass. <laughs> but you ain't. You still use talk to me. Really? Talk to me? Really? Talk to me. Oh, you like spreading shit on bread and stuff. It's kind of cool to chill. <laughs> you like spreading shit around on your skin, talking about you clean. You nasty. Your drawers dirty. You dirty. Your ass dirty. Your skin dirty. <laughs> Nigga, get you some like, uh, 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 He's stupid. Y'all got excuse because of Kuda, but he's telling the truth, though. And that, that was my video about video for the day, anyway. You know how when you have a baby, you you wipe your baby up with baby wipes, okay? So when we're all born, for the most part, I would honestly say 90% of us was uh, were clean with baby wipes because they were wet. So, if our bottoms was cleaned with baby wipes, where do we get the idea to use toilet paper to wipe our ass? I got to have this conversation because it's a lot of nasty asses walking around. And that's what Cutter Cooler was talking to me about. He said, people just filthy. I said, what you mean? He said, they just, he said, when you was born, he said, didn't your parents use baby wipes? I said, yeah. He said, well, well, why? What made you go to toilet paper? I said, well, Cousin Cooter, I ain't used toilet paper in a long time. <laughs> he said, but, he said, but, man, 90% of African Americans use toilet paper. 
He said, you see what happened when COVID hit and they were running to the stores to get all the toilet paper off the shelves. He said, what you think they were doing with the toilet paper? I said, well, they were probably wiping their ass. He said, point in case. He said, so why did we start cleaning ourselves with toilet paper when we were born, our parents were using baby wipes? I said, that's a damn good question, Cousin Koo, because I ain't never felt comfortable using toilet paper. So this conversation me and him was having today, I, which I thought was pretty good because he kind of stupid. But he tells the truth. And he said, you know, we should not be using toilet paper to clean our ass. We just shouldn't. And it made sense to me. If you're using toilet paper. Your ass you go, is dirty. You just thought it was clean. Your ass is dirty if you use toilet paper. <laughs> you just spread that shit on your booty. <laughs> you got a dirty ass. I'll show you what God I'm talking about. <laughs> I got some good. shitty ass. Wipe your ass with something wet and stop using toilet paper. That's some white people shit. Uh, your mama used uh, baby wipes and now you use a toilet paper. You stupid. <laughs> Why, why he do, why he say stupid stuff like that? I, I mean, I don't get it, but I do get it because he wants y'all to wake up. They have things called bidets, a bidet. You know, Europe uses them more, you know, your Asia, your, they, those guys use that, but in America, we use them less and I don't get it. Being clean is everything to me. So I've always been using baby wipes. I mean, but I think this conversation needs to be had because there are a lot of people just don't know that there's a better way to clean. You know, you clean your baby with baby wipe, but you clean yourself with toilet paper. Toilet paper spreads like a knife does peanut butter, unless it's crunching peanut butter. So, you know, stop using the toilet paper. Use baby wipes or get yourself a bidet. That makes you more cleaner. And clean is everything. I mean, who wants to get next to somebody that's got a dirty ass? I mean, you know, and then some people be wiping up. Your ass is back here, but you wipe it up. Oh, hell no. <laughs> Again, as an herbalist, it's my job to teach people there are better solutions. Just like herbs, you know, herbs are a better solution when it comes to health. You know, medication got no minerals and nutrients. Let me say that again. Medication has no minerals and nutrients, but herbs do. So I said that to say, you want the best above the rest because the best is going to give a benefit when the rest won't. If you know you don't get minerals and nutrients from medication, what's the purpose of medication? Your body requires a specific element from the earth to heal you. Your body requires intelligence to clean you, for you to be clean. I mean, you use it on your babies. Why would you stop? So, again, it was a conversation I was having with Cousin Cooter Crazy Ass, and he was just talking about how, as a baby, we did that. So, you know, if you're using toilet paper, there's a better way. Get yourself a bidet. They dirt cheap on Amazon. They dirt cheap. I ain't I ain't making nothing from them. You know, I'm just saying, as your herbalist, I want you to have the best, greatest benefit. Now, I will say this about a bidet. When that water sprays up and cleans you, that shit feel good. You leaving the bathroom knowing that you clean. You cleaner than you was before you walked in there. Can you imagine? Facebook. I'm on my Facebook Live. That's where I'm at. Any case, somebody's trying to find me, but they can't find me. Let me go see if it's working, because, you know, sometimes Facebook be holding me off, man. They don't be wanting me to go live and stuff, because I be dropping pure knowledge. I be dropping pure knowledge. When you drop knowledge, you're hindered. When you uh, when you say some stupid shit, they'll put you out there. But when you drop dropping some knowledge, they won't put you out there. Ain't that some shit? Okay, I can't find my streaming live here. Man, they're always holding a brother down. You know what I'm saying? But I ain't going to let him stop me. Don't you let him stop you either. Get this knowledge and run with it. Go get yourself a bidet. Use some baby wipes. You know what I'm saying? Clean yourself up. Because a clean body heals better than a dirty body. You know, you get all crusty and shit. You know, you're just going to cause other problems, other shit to grow. You know, and I'm only doing a quick video today because I got a class to go to. But, you know, stay clean. You know, Bidet, baby wipes, 
herbs www.herbsoftheforest.com I don't sell no bidets though you know what I'm saying you got to get your own bidet because the cooter might sell you a bidet but you know I ain't got no bidet but in any case you got an herbist that's looking out for you so take advantage of it you know what I'm saying did I mention that if you took a number two and you just used toilet paper what if that shit was crunchy? <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. When you wipe your ass, you got to have baby wipes or water. Toilet paper spread shit like a butter knife on bread, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Unless it's crunchy. <laughs> crunchy to the bread. So you can imagine your ass after a dump and you using toilet paper. For real though, toilet paper? Who use toilet paper nowadays? <laughs> He's stupid. Man, your drawers dirty. I already know you got some dirty drawers. I sure wouldn't want to meet you. <laughs> he is stupid. I'm sorry, y'all. Cousin Cooter is a rap type. Okay, you can't. You gotta listen to it because he's profound sometimes. He says some profound stuff, but <laughs> this shit makes sense to me. Uh, so again www.herbsoftheforest.com I got anything you need you know got over 100 products okay there's an 888-619-4372 number to call and you can actually chat with me from the website you got any questions you know somebody you know share this video you know somebody go to learn from this shit okay and that's the purpose of every video I do not to tell you what to do but to help you grow and if I can say anything positive to help you get to the next level that's what Herbs of the Force is all about. You know what I'm saying? Now, I got my partners and stuff who got a crazy shit, but, you know, they help me out. You know, they, they keep me going. They, they keep me smiling, you know what I'm saying? Because, <laughs> uh, you know, living in this world for a black man is not easy, okay? So, again, this was a short video to let you know. Stop using toilet paper. Because, like he said, it's like you, you, the toilet paper spread shit on your ass like a butter knife or a bread with peanut butter, okay? So that's what he said. <laughs> okay, so like, I'm forging up. You can find me at www.herbsoftheforce.com because I got them herbs. I got them herbs, okay? So come on out. Come on over. Holler at me. Talk to me. Ask some questions. I got a shitload of answers. Literally, I got a lot of answers. And uh, I'm sure I can help you in some way or another, no matter what kind of problem you got. Everything's confidential. Reach out to me. This was just a quick one, you know, before I go to my class. Again, thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. You know, I'm on Facebook. I'm on Instagram. I'm on YouTube. You know, you're going to learn from me. If you don't do nothing, you're going to get a laugh and you're going to learn. And I think the greater part of all of this is about learning. So find out what herbs are good for your particular issue because I got them herbs. Okay? I got them herbs. Thanks for watching. I'm Forrest Gump. Peace. Ah. Uh.